Hey guys, in today's video, I will be reviewing the top 8 best wireless keyboards. I made this list based on my personal experience and I try to rank them based on their quality, durability, customer reviews, and more. If you want to know about the best pricing and more information, you can check the description links below. Number 8 in my list is Nufi Air 75 V2 Wireless Keyboard. The Nufi Air 75 V2 is the best wireless mechanical keyboard at a mid-range price point. This keyboard offers solid build quality, high portability, and impressive connectivity options. Its keycaps also feel great, and their slim tile-like design keeps your fingertips comfortably hovering right over them. Just note that these keycaps don't have shine through legends, so although the keyboard has full RGB backlighting, you can't rig the key legends in darker environments. There are two switches along the top of the board. One to switch between operating system compatibility and one to toggle between connection types. It connects with its included USB receiver, or you can connect and pair with up to three devices via Bluetooth. Nufi also sells variants of this keyboard that are exactly the same, but in different sizes. These include the smaller Nufi Air 60 V2 and the larger Nufi Air 96 V2. Number 7 in my list is Razer Pro Type Ultra Wireless Keyboard. Of all the keyboards we've tested, we recommend the Razer Pro Type Ultra as the best wireless keyboard for most people. It may look like a straightforward office model with an Apple-inspired white and chrome aesthetic. However, it's a surprisingly versatile mechanical keyboard suitable for productivity, everyday browsing, and competitive gaming. It also offers impressive ergonomic features with two adjustable typing angles and an included wrist rest. It doesn't lack connectivity options either. It comes with a Razer productivity dongle that you can pair with select Razer mice, like the Razer Pro Click or its smaller counterpart, the Razer Pro Click Mini. You can also pair it with up to three devices simultaneously using Bluetooth. If there's a downside, it's that this keyboard doesn't come in a variety of switch options, and its full-size form factor means it may take up too much space on small desks. Number six in my list is Asus ROG Falchion and its wireless keyboard. The Asus ROG Falchion NX packs just about every feature you could need from a gaming keyboard into as small a space as possible. Thanks to its arrow keys, navigation keys, innovative side touch panel, and wireless macro recording capabilities, you don't have to worry about losing functionality with this board, despite its 65% frame. This board also boasts Asus's in-house and its switches, which we thought felt noticeably smoother than Cherry MS switches in our review. They also proved a touch louder during our testing, but they should still be a suitable alternative for anyone exhausted with Cherry's and its clones. Dominance over the switch market. Red, linear, brown, tactile, and blue clicky options are all available here. This board does have per-key RGB lighting, although customizing it means navigating Asus's clunky Aura Creator software. Making up for that, though, are other premium features like double-shot PPT keycaps and the ability to connect over both a USB-C to USB-A cable and 2.4 GHz wireless. Add in the side touch panel's ability to hold up to five gesture-based actions, and that makes this an extremely viable board for all sorts of use cases, which isn't something you can always say about 65% keyboards. Number five in my list is SteelSeries Apex Pro TKL Wireless Keyboard. SteelSeries Apex Pro TKL Wireless borrows the Apex Pro Mini's sturdy, minimal, and more generic-looking chassis design. Adding the company's updated, highly customizable dual actuation Omni.2.0 optical switches. The keyboard also packs plenty of premium features like an aluminum alloy top plate, double shot PBT keycaps, bright per key RGB, and a detachable magnetic wrist rest. The Apex Pro TKL slash Apex Pro TKL wireless roomier layout allows for dedicated media keys and a customizable OLED smart display. Also, unlike its predecessor, it comes in both wired and wireless versions. The Apex Pro TKL Wireless is an excellent, highly customizable gaming keyboard in a TKL layout, 
which is much less restrictive than the Apex Pro Mini 60% layout. But we're still holding out for an update to the full-size SteelSeries Apex Pro to rival Razer's excellent Deathstalker V2 Pro. Number 4 in my list is Razer Deathstalker V2 Pro Wireless Keyboard. Razer's Deathstalker V2 Pro is a totally different animal from its predecessor. And that's a good thing. It's an attractive low-profile keyboard that has basically all the features you need. Connectivity, customization, and pretty lights. Plus a surprisingly decent typing experience and an excellent gaming experience. It's not exactly, as Razer claims, built like a tank. But it's pretty durable for how small, slim, and lightweight it is. Number 3 in my list is Corsair K100 Wireless Keyboard. Corsair has created something unique with the K100 Air Wireless RGB, while there are still some areas for improvement, like the shine on the keycaps. This is the thinnest mechanical gaming keyboard I've seen from a large gaming brand, and Corsair has nailed the execution. At just 11 millimeters thick at its thinnest point, it's immediately reminiscent of the chiclet keys of yesteryear but it manages to deliver an impressive mechanical keyboard typing and gaming experience. At $279, it's unquestionably expensive but succeeds in being the most feature-rich and satisfying gaming keyboard in its class. Number 2 in my list is Razer Blackwido V3 Pro Mechanical Wireless Keyboard. The Razer Blackwido V3 Pro is our favorite wireless keyboard for gaming because it offers you a full-size, full-height mechanical switch experience, plus all the features you'd expect in a premium gaming clacker. You also get a cozy plush leatherette magnetic wrist rest and four onboard memory profiles. Unfortunately, you'll need the software to use any RGB besides the seven effects stored in the keyboard's memory. And there are no macro keys, like the Logitech G915 Lightspeed offers. The Blackwhite OV3 Pro can connect with a wireless dongle via its included charging cable or through Bluetooth, which lets it pair with up to three additional PCs. Battery life varies based on backlight brightness and effect, but can range from 5 to 25 hours with lighting and reach 192 hours without. And at 3% battery life, the Blackwhite OV3 Pro can get wonky, with delays in registering key presses and issues with the software finding it. But ultimately, the Black YOV3 Pro delivers everything you'd expect from an expensive, top-of-the-line gaming keyboard, except a mandatory cable. There's also a newer Black YOV3 Mini model, although it doesn't bring as much to the table for its price as its larger sibling. Number one in my list is Asus ROG Strix Scope Wireless Keyboard. Asus's ROG Strix Scope 296 Wireless is just about everything you could want in a wireless gaming keyboard. It's speedy, responsive, and reliable while gaming, customizable, and it gets up to 1,500 hours of battery life over its low-latency 2.4 GHz wireless connection. It has a 96% layout, which means it's relatively compact saving desk space without sacrificing the 10-key number pad. The ROG Strix Scope P96 Wireless is sturdily built with an aluminum alloy top plate and double shot PPT keycaps. It does have a plastic chassis, necessary, according to ASUS, for reliable wireless connectivity, but it's got multiple layers of sound dampening foam inside to minimize case ping. It comes with ASUS's second gen ROG NX Snow linear mechanical switches, which have an actuation force of 45 gram and are stable, smooth, and quiet. It's also got a hot swappable PCB, so you can swap the NX Snows out for the switches of your choice. This keyboard is wireless. That's why it's on this page, with both low latency 2.4 GHz wireless and Bluetooth 5.1 connectivity. ASUS says it will get up to 1,500 hours of battery life over 2.4 GHz wireless with the lighting turned off, which is fantastic, though this number drops precipitously with the lighting turned on. The ROG Strix Scope 296 wireless isn't quite as fancy as its pricier sibling. Alright guys, this was our today's video. If you find this video helpful for you, then like the video and if you come to our channel first time.
Then hit the subscribe button for our amazing upcoming videos. Be sure to the check out the links in the description for the updated price of all products discussed in this video. Hope you have a great day and see you soon in the next video.